in a system when the there is a lot of tryptophan around in the system the tryptophan binds to a um, protein complex that binds to the operator sequence when activated making it dissociated from the operator region making that site available for rna polymerase to bind to it and now when rna polymerase binds to it it is going to walk down the street and start the transcription for the trip operon gene so just by having a repressor that is controlled by the amount of tryptophan in the environment by allowing it to bind or not be available to bind. This is a very simple, elegant system that controls when you need more tryptophan, it gets activated and it gets transcribed and then it can be translated. Now, any questions so far, by the way, before we look at a second level of control for this?